So, what's up? <laughs> this is Christian. LRC. I, like, am not super getting better <laughs> from what I got hit with last week. Today, I'm, like, <clears throat> way tired. Been tired since when I woke up, so this is going to be, like, the most pathetic 31 days of character creation video ever. It's day 11. <laughs> and I'm just going to... I'm just gonna make up stuff. First off, the th the prompt. I'm just gonna make it exhaustion. That's the prompt, exhaustion. And then I'm just gonna use my brain to be a random number generator. And also, because I don't have the sheet in front of me, I'm just gonna make stuff up. So let's see. The first roll for ancestry. That's a three, and I'm gonna say that that is. <laughs> I'm gonna say that that is gnome, and then uh, culture. Uh, I'm gonna roll a three again. Oh, so weird. The culture is um, is tiefling, <laughs> and then uh, the uh, the the class. So gnome ancestry, tiefling culture class. I'm gonna roll a seven. And that is um, Warlock. <laughs> and then the uh, the background, uh, let's see, D20. Yeah, okay. That's a, a 16. And I'm going to say that that's Sailor. <laughs> so Gnome, Tiefling. Um, <laughs> gnome, Tiefling, Warlock, Sailor. And I'm going to say they're non-binary. Uh, okay, this gnome tiefling, uh, warlock sailor. Mm, I would like for them to be, um, <coughs> a sailor who's, uh, let's say a captain. And I want to imagine that, um, you know, this is a, this is a, a, a sailor who, you know, gnomes are not really known for being, you know, seafaring folk, but, um, with this particular culture is really brought on board um, a tiefling uh, seafaring group of people. And um, they uh, were <sighs> captain on this boat when, um, you know, let's do like uh, choppy seas and, uh, you know, this horrible, not even choppy, just this horrible, you know, like, uh, like um, typhoon. And, uh, you know, it just, uh, it, it sank the ship, it killed the crew, and, and here we have our character who was just left floating um, in the middle of the sea. And uh, they uh, looked, let's say looked down to uh, a, a, an ocean or sea deity and, and just begged for help in being able to um, make it through um, this harrowing experience. And uh, their, their call was answered by, um, you know, some eldritch depth deity um, who grabs them by, by the leg and drags them deep, deep down. Um, and, uh, you know, to the point of drowning and, um, in that sort of, you know, space between life and death, they uh, were granted um, the power to save themselves and um, sort of imagine just like shooting up out of the sea and, uh, you know, in, in the sort of dregs of this storm uh, hovering over the, over the sea and uh, then being able to, you know, essentially fly back to uh, land. And um, the bargain here, however, was that they can never be too far away from the sea or they lose their um, packed uh, gifts, basically. Um, and uh, well, I'm going to roll some numbers here for skills. Uh, first roll is a, um, it's an eight for strength. Uh, 
And the dex roll, uh, oh, okay. Oh, that's a 14. They're very dexy. You know, you got to be if you work on a ship. Uh, con roll is going to be um, 11, just kind of average. Uh, they weren't like a great swimmer when it comes down to it. Um, intelligence roll is going to be a, uh, that's going to be another 11. Um, and the wisdom roll uh, I'll give them a little bump up on that, make that like a 13. And then the charisma roll, um, I'll make that uh, a 12. Um, so, you know, you need that charisma to connect with um, your your deity. And uh, I'm going to name this character... <sighs> um, I want it to be something C-oriented. Um... <laughs> this character is um, depth depth captain. Ooh, I like that as a title. Depth captain. Um, uh, sea force. <laughs> depth captain. Sea force. <laughs> All right. Thanks for tuning in for this pathetic episode of 31 days of character creation and bye